Hey there, everyone. I just did a training today in the world and um, in the EXP environment for our training. And uh, today's training was about uh, virtual open houses. And so when I was there, I gave everybody the ability to be able to download my ebook. And so what I wanted to show you is um, how when somebody registers for something, be it an ebook or, you know, your top 10 checklist on why people are going to net millions more listing with you, you know, whatever whatever call to action that you have and you use a uh, landing page, I want to be able to show you guys how you then can grab that, add in a bunch of hashtags or add in additional hashtags and then do a mass mailing back to them. Um, so what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to quickly share my screen. All right. So this is my KV core. Um, the training session was about an hour ago, and we can see 16 people had registered for the ebook out of the group that was there. And so we get the notification that it was there. Uh, actually, my phone was blowing up during the conversation. Um, they were letting me know that I had new leads coming in. I set up my KV Core to do that. So as soon as a new lead comes in, I get the phone call, right? We've talked about it a few times, speed to lead. Um, a lot of times we get the lead and it takes time or we miss a text or email. I literally have my phone call me and tell me that, hey, we got a new lead for KV Core. So uh, I forgot to turn it down and all of a sudden it was blown up in the training. So I had to turn that off. Um, so what I'm doing is I'm hitting smart CRM because what I'm wanting to do, I'm going to do two things. Number one, I'm going to add a hashtag to them. And then number two, I'm going to uh, send a mass email out just with some of the information from today's session. So I'm going to look down. We can see the virtual open house training was a hashtag that I had created. So as soon as they had registered, um, as soon as they had registered in the landing page, the lead was auto populated and it was given the hashtag virtual open house training. So what I want to do is I want to go to more actions. I want to add in a hashtag. I would like them to be in EXP uh, I'm just going to say referral realtor because if I have, so what I'm going to ask them to do is I'm going to send them an email asking them to tell me what market they're in so that if I have a referral for that market, um, it's very easy for me to refer out to the company. So I'm going to put them as a EXP referral realtor in the email. I'm going to ask them to give me their information back in their market so that when they share their market with me, I'm then going to come in and put in a hashtag of Hamilton realtor, for example, or realtor Hamilton. Sorry. I always do realtor first and then the city. Um, so then that way, when I have a referral to Hamilton, I can just quickly pull it up. So I'm just going to add in EXP referral realtor so that I know when I want to send a referral out, it goes to them. And then I'm going to send out a mass email to all of them, basically asking for their contact info back. Um, as some of you know, with templates, I tend to put symbols in front. So thanks for attending um, is the template email that I've set up. Uh, if you're one of the 16 that's receiving this email. Uh, I'm not making it in, I'm not trying to make it impersonal. What I want to do is make sure that you get all the information. And we talked about it today is I'm a big believer of Im imperfect action. So I'd much rather get this out to you and have it be a little bit impersonal, but make sure that you have all the information rather than you missing up. So uh, there is how the email looks. Um, because they don't have their first names when I register, I didn't put that in. Just basically letting them know that I'd like them to reply with their info and then they can get some of the information that we had talked about today. So I always take a look and make sure that the, um, the subject line is filled out, which it is. And there's 16 contacts that it's going to that were selected. So then all I have to do is hit send. And it's been sent out to the 16 contacts. It's just that easy. And actually, if we click on one, here, I'm going to click on the first one just so we can see how they came in. We see at 349 today, 
Um, who is it? Janine um, requested to download the free ebook. Um, it put in the hashtag automatically. I have no rules set up for this group um, because I just wanted them to be able to get it and then reach out to them and ask if I can add them to my referral network. Uh, so now I've added, you just saw I added the EXP referral realtor hashtag. And so we'll see when the rest of it comes. But I do have their phone number and I do have their email. And um, yeah, oh, and it also auto populates that they're an agent. That's important because then they're not getting the buyer lead uh, drip campaigns or the seller lead drip campaigns. So that's also very important. Um, so it's just that easy. Hope this helps. And um, yeah, go out and start to create some of your own landing pages. I know one of my mentees, Gary, uh, had did a post on Facebook. I'm just going to show you the example of how this can work. He did a post on Facebook. Uh, he's selling an investment property. So we put it into a Facebook group, didn't spend a penny. And I forget how many leads he had, 40 maybe that came through and contacted him. And so he had to get the listing information out to all 40 of them. And so next time we talked, um, he's like, oh, it was crazy. I did the post, I got all these leads and now I got to communicate with them on Facebook and it was a real challenge. And so then I showed him how to do the landing page so that if they wanted the information, all they had to do was register and receive it. He was able to shift, you know, contacting with 40 people took forever and he was behind getting it. Showed him how to use the landing page how to get it out to him. And uh, it probably saved him hours in his next post that went through. Um, so that's another way that it could be used is if you had a specific hot property that he wanted to send out a performa to, that's what it was. He wanted to send out a performa. So he just said, Hey, if you want the information, download the performa. But now he's got all these people in there that with the next listing that came up, he was able to send them a mass text or an email. So another way that this can be done. So anyway, Thanks everyone for coming in. And uh, if you have any questions, let me know. And uh, we'll talk to you soon. Oh, if you can do me a favor, if you like this video, just give me a thumbs up uh, and do me a favor and subscribe to the channel because I will have a lot of little tools like this, not only KV Core related, but real estate related. We will be doing some interviews with different realtors along the way as well, trying to provide some value and uh, it's my belief that together everyone achieves more. And so long as we can share ideas back and forth, our ideas will continuously grow. There's enough business out there for all of us. And so let's just make the industry better. Thanks, subscribe, like this video, and we'll talk to you soon.